The question many people have is, can I drink after I get Botox? Yes, you can indulge in an alcoholic beverage. You should be able to have a glass of wine or alcoholic beverage without compromising the effectiveness of your injections. But, Drinking a lot after a Botox injection can have adverse health effects. Talk to your doctor about the best practices for drinking before and after your injection. If you drink before a visit, your blood will be thinner and more prone to bruising. This means that if you bruise around the treated area, it's more likely the alcohol contributed. But luckily, this isn't the only concern. Alcohol has an impact on how your blood flows, which can lead to other problems down the road. One other thing that has been reported to affect blood pressure is vitamin E high sodium foods, high sugar foods, and niacin supplement. You'll need to consult your doctor or a professional and Botox cosmetic professionals at the treatment center to find out more information and what you should avoid. Additionally, it is always a good idea to contact your plastic surgeon about the necessary precautions you need to take after having Botox done. After at least 24 hours, moderate alcohol consumption is recommended after the procedures in order to prevent further damage. From a health perspective, there's no concern about possible side effects after the injection of Botox. So, how long should I wait after Botox to drink alcohol? You may want to wait a few days before you drink alcohol after having Botox. After a procedure, it is usually best to wait two days before drinking alcohol. You'll want to wait a bit longer if you plan on shaking a cocktail shaker, depending on how your skin feels and how you're feeling. Is there anything else I should avoid after getting Botox? To avoid the risk of blood loss or an allergic reaction, it's important to avoid taking any blood thinning medications after your treatment. You'll also need to avoid putting on makeup and going out in the sun until you've completely recovered. Because recovery from Botox is a fairly easy process, other than avoiding these things, you can typically go about life as normal after injections. There are a few things to keep in mind. 1. Bruising. The most common reaction to Botox injections is a bruise at the injection site. Alcohol makes your blood thinner which does increase the chances of bruising. But that doesn't mean you'll definitely acquire a bruise, it's just more likely. If you know you bruise easily, then I would avoid alcohol because it only increases those odds. 2. Dizziness. Medical treatments are best when they involve as little guesswork as possible. That's why it's important to think of B equals Botox as just that, a treatment, and not a magic pill. After the procedure, you may experience dizziness or drowsiness. Sound a little familiar? If it does, that's probably because being too relaxed can result in similar symptoms. So even though there will never be a one-size-fits-all prescription, Botox works for many people, and we hope it can work for you. 3. Swelling. In addition, drinking alcohol after Botox can cause some undesirable side effects. When you drink alcohol, your blood rate slows and may affect whether or not your Botox takes full effect and how long it lasts. The additional blood flow from drinking lots of goo in a short amount of time can widen the spaces between your capillaries and make the tissues around them fill with fluid. This is the scientific term for swollen soft tissue. Before you make plans to drink while recovering from Botox, you should know that it could cause some complications. The reactions can range in severity but they are not life-threatening. Just make an informed decision about when to drink after receiving Botox. Was this helpful? Kindly like, share, and subscribe to our channel.